Well, I think one thing that Canadians won't miss about Stephen Harper uh, is Stephen Harper. Um, he has been a very effective Prime Minister. He has sought to make the country a more conservative place, and I think in the main he has succeeded. But he is a very secretive, introverted, autocratic and controlling individual, um, and I don't think that element of the Prime Ministership will be missed. And I guess that leads to the second thing, which is the nature of the government that, that flows from the leader, which is itself autocratic, secretive and cruel in some respects and at some times, that isn't consultative, that isn't transparent, uh, that doesn't seek the abuse of the bureaucracy, of stakeholders, of the general public. I think people will be looking for a government that is more transparent, that is more open, that is more accountable. I don't know if they'll get it, but they're going to be looking for it. And I think the third thing that they will not miss is some elements of the law and order agenda, which will be reversed. I think many of those elements were valid, were justified, could be defended, but some seem to just be punitive, some seem to just be cruel. And uh, there are some major things that he did not do uh, that need to be done. For example, as a result of Supreme Court decisions on the decriminalization of prostitution, um, on right to life legislation. We will want to see the next government take actions in the, in the areas where he didn't act as well as perhaps reversing some of the areas in which he did.